discrete ballistics ammunition round. It's going to be the first one into the block. I'm going to shoot it on the top right corner. So I'm going to take a position here. Got the safety on. Going to take the flag out. And guys, remember when you chamber a centerfire round, keep it pointed at the berm. Just in case something should happen, it's going to be contained. All right, so here we go. We're going to shoot that block top right. There we have it. Let's put a flag in it. Take a look at it. Okay, as you can see, the machine bullet opened up really quick. And let's see how much penetration we got here. We got a piece of a tape measure. So I'm gonna cut a foot and see. So we got 18, about 18 and a half inches, and the bullet stayed in one piece. So, as you can see from the high-speed video, it started opening up, had a pretty good wound cavity. Let's go ahead and uh, see if we can get him out of there without cutting the finger here. We got two other bullets to shoot and uh, haven't been cut with bullets before. We're going to try to be a little careful here. Well, like I said, a little. What you want to remember when we're doing this, this kind of ballistic stuff, there's no clothing or anything on it, no barrier in front of the gelatin. So this is just raw gelatin exposure to the projectile. And you can see it opened up uh, three petals just like it 